Uh, she was, okay, seriously, Daniel Radcliffe, what are you what? doing with your money? That's crazy. I, but it, like Tram said, I kind of do find it refreshing, though, that he's living Absolutely. a very, it sounds like he's living a very minimalist lifestyle, maybe, if he's hardly touched any of it. That's just me being jealous. But even living I off a that. million of it, you're still living pretty <laughs> large, yeah. so... Good for you, Daniel. Uh, yeah. Good for you, Harry Potter. Well, in the meantime, today is World Teacher Day, and today we're introducing you to a Valley teacher who just won an award celebrating her work. Team 12's J.R. Cardenas talks to an A-plus teacher, Annette Deanda. Today, we're in Mrs. Deanda's classroom at Brinton Elementary in Mesa. She's a highly effective academic teacher, but in addition to the academics, um, she creates a really wonderful, warm, and caring environment for the kids, and I think that's what is so genuine. Mrs. Deanda is a second grade teacher from Yuma who knew she wanted to teach from a very young age. My mother inspired me to be a teacher. She taught for 30 years. I grew up with her as a teacher. I moved out here to go to ASU in, in 1998, and I be in the medical field, but my heart wanted to be a teacher. So I started my career as a teacher in, as soon as I started ASU. Mrs. DeAnda won the Riddell Exemplary Teacher Award in 2005, just a couple of years after she began teaching. The most rewarding thing about being a teacher is coming to work every day and seeing my students. It's a gift. I walk in here, I teach, with the hopes of inspiring them to learn. And it is the biggest gift that I can get on a daily basis. In any job, you can get burnt out. So I would just encourage her to stay, um, continue to learn, continue to grow as a teacher, as an educator, so that she has that long career. And may she continue to be an A-plus teacher. J.R. Cardenas, 12 News. What a gift to those oh, kids, right? Absolutely. Well, we asked you on Twitter and also